All right. Listen, really good team win. Played a good team uh, in Northern Kentucky. Have a lot of respect for them. Uh, we played very, very well. And um, it was great to see. I mean, you just don't know during this time of the year how you're going to compete each night. But so far, we've continued to to really, really uh, scrap and claw. Um, 25 assists was awesome. And uh, we've got to continue that 11 steals. We did a great job. Can you hear me, Rob? I can. Yeah, just talk about, you know, you're playing a tough team. You're playing that zone they run um, and, and getting off to the start that you did. Yep. I thought our ball movement early in the in the game was fantastic. And, um, you know, to have 52 points at halftime, to have 15 assists mm -hmm. at halftime against that team uh, means that we shot it well, means that we moved it well. Even the possessions we didn't score, the ball was zipping all over the court. Uh, it was great to see. You know, they they pressure you in with their transition offense and uh, that that you know we don't play quite as fast as they do but uh, we were able to in the second half I think you know get back in transition and um, we competed as hard as we could and it was it was a really good win for us. Um, you know, again, you just never know what you're going to get when you got new guys and to be able to play. Uh string together several games and, and, and be able to play as well as you have and kind of connected as you have. Just yeah. kind of talk about that. Great, yeah, great start. All the credit goes to these guys, you know, trying to get a lot of new guys in. And look, right now I'm playing some of the returning guys and experienced guys a lot of heavy minutes because, you know, their experience and, and, and how we're playing. Uh, but I do think as the year goes on, you'll see – more out of James and Jerry and, you know, more and more down the line. But Gabe has been really good, uh, physical, tough. We're, we're, we're going to add, you know, Nunu here soon. And maybe I can take some of these minutes away from, from, you know, some of these other guys that are playing a ton. But right now, you know, Gio's done a great job. Malik, when he's not in foul trouble tonight, he wasn't in foul trouble. Great job. Four steals, seven assists. Um, Mike Nuga, Danny, Justin, you know, they've all been playing really at a high level. And uh, it's good to see, but we have more in the tank. I think we, we, we can continue to get better as long as we, uh, as long as we understand that, that, that we're not there yet, we'll continue to get better. You almost kind of expect a team like that to run at you in that second half. And I think they got yeah. it to nine and that's as close as they got. Every time they would come, you would, you would answer. Yeah. Yeah. Couple of guys would hit a big shot here or there, or get a big turnover. You know, there was a couple of times we got sloppy, and they they cut it. I think to ten a couple of times. I don't know if they got it. Maybe they got it to nine. Then we'd hit a big basket. Usually for Ian here, you know, I can't. Uh, make a big play, and that that's what it takes. Rob, can, you, and, uh, can you talk about Justin, game he had? Yeah, he's been fantastic. I think I said that to you the other day leading into the game. You know, he, he's been great. Um, tonight, 11 for 13. And, you know, almost every one of his baskets, he got a couple offensive rebounds, but almost every one of his baskets outside of that is assisted. So it's, it's him being in the right spot and finishing and guys finding him in those creases. Um, you know, he, he's been really good and he allows us defensively, you know, he takes some pressure off of Danny because now Danny can guard different guys and he can guard different guys. And, um, it allows us his versatility defensively, I think really helps our team as well. Um, you know, we got to continue to get better. Like I said, it, it's, it's, it's still the start, but we've certainly had a promising start here uh, with all of the new faces and, you know, not knowing what we were going to have. Uh, it's good to see these guys compete. I think we're really competing hard, which uh, is a big deal right now because there's no crowds, there's no nothing to, to help you compete. So uh, seeing that is, is really positive. We just got to keep building on it and keep getting better. Also talk about Danny Ed. 19-7 and six assists. Yeah. I'm sure that's his a career high in assists. 
if he could have eliminated some of those turnovers, he might've had 10 assists tonight, right? Like uh, that's, that's, you know, some things, again, we trust him with the basketball. He's still got to make better decisions, but I think he's getting more comfortable, seven rebounds, six assists. I, I'm almost positive that's a career high. And he's going to have the ball, you know, a lot and, and going to have to make decisions a lot. The zone, you know, he's not practicing every day. So some of these things when they're flying at him, you know, he, he's got to make those adjustments. But he also made a couple big shots when I think they cut it to nine or they cut it to 10. You know, he'd make a shot and make it 13. We had a kick out three you know, that he hit in front of our bench. So he, he's, he's, he's playing really well the way a senior, uh, you know, is supposed to.